Moo! Ah, hello! How are you all today? What a lovely day it is! The sun is shining. Well, it's been lovely for the last few days, I think, actually. The sun has been shining lovely. And what, what it just brings about happiness, I feel. So, hello, I am Matthew Oliver, your wedding planner, here to help you plan your fantastic day with these ridiculous videos. <laughs> Um, all with different inspirations and ideas and just to help you along the planning process so you've got someone just to give you a little bit of a nudge on certain elements and sectors of your wedding. Anyway, so today's five reasons is five reasons um, you should research and compare at least three suppliers um, for each factor. So obviously each, you know, each, you know, florists, photographers, venues, cake makers, videographers, hair and makeup, you know, every single factor for your wedding supplier. So it's good to look at three people just because you get ideas and they're all completely different. You don't get the same supplier twice. So that's why it's important to look at um, three at least um, because you need to find someone that you're going to get along with. I always say that there's a supplier for everyone out there because there's loads of them out there and with, that will obviously meet your style, your design and be perfect for you because you can't just go for the one that's just been, you know, who's just down the road from you or someone that's just been recommended to you by your best friend or mum who had their wedding recently and they think you should have them. You need to have someone because they, they can be a completely different style to you. So it's important that you have someone that is perfect for you. Anyway, I've rambled on quite a lot already. So here are the five reasons why to research and compare at least three suppliers from each factor. So number one, it gives you options and choices. You know I love options and choices. Options and choices for a wedding is how it works. You know, you need options for every single element of the wedding so you know that that's the perfect, that's the right direction you have to go in. Okay, so make sure, you know, you're looking at free so you choose the best one. Second reason, find which one you prefer, you relate to, and see yourself working with. Because, you know, the worst thing is you might, oh, love this person, but you might not actually see working together on the actual day of the wedding, because that's the most important thing. You're actually hiring them to do the job, you know, not to be your best friend. Okay, that's the best part, you know, you need to get along with them, and that's the really important, but also you need to make sure that they're going to actually do the, they're going to produce on the day of your wedding. So just, you know, remember that as well. Third reason, you look at for different features and elements, so don't, don't obviously look for quality, creativeness, and just obviously look at different ones, you know, don't just look at the same style because obviously it's good to see what that other one can bring you and if they can be versatile and create that wedding for you with what you're looking for. So just make sure that you're looking at um, organisation, creativity, different price ranges, so you just got an idea and they're all completely different so that obviously narrows it down as well for you. Fourth reason, compare prices and see what you get from each. Okay, this is a very important reason because one could be this much and one could be this much and it could obviously narrow it down to that for you but you might want to go for the most expensive because you know that they're the ones that you get better along with and they're the ones that are going to produce on the day of the wedding. Okay. Fifth and final reason, don't be scared to negotiate on costs because this could be the final factor. So make sure you know, each of them, if you're looking at three and one saying this, one saying that and one saying this, but there's one in particular that you absolutely love, um, but they're a little bit more pricey, just make sure, you know, ask them, you know, just say you're looking at other ones, but I actually relate to you the most because I feel like we get along the best and I know that you can do it perfectly for me. So don't be scared to do that because that's how it works. This is how business runs and how the world works these days. So these are just a little few reasons on why you should be looking at free, you know, suppliers in each factor from all across the board, from everything to do with your wedding, just so that you get an idea, you get an inspiration and you've got choices, you've got options for each. Also, just a little word of advice, if their website, you know, look at their websites, but some websites are not as good as other websites. Don't make that, don't be put off because a lot of suppliers websites um, are you know old-fashioned but that doesn't mean that they're not perfect for you so make sure you look at the experience look at how much work they've done and just like you know keep an eye on that as well don't just feel like be scared because their website design anyway that's me done I hope you enjoyed the video I thank you for watching and my, look, this bit here is really annoying me so I do apologize about that in my video today because obviously it's not very good um, 
presentation for you. Anyway, thanks for watching. I really hope this has helped and give you an insight into what you should be doing. Um, thank you all for watching. Love you all. Don't forget to share this with everyone and, you know, share it to the world. Love you all and speak to you soon. Bye-bye. Adios. Adios.